Laura Spencer here for Tuts Plus. Today I'm going to show you how to use the Gmail search utility. Did you know that Gmail includes a powerful search utility? It's a great way to manage your inbox. Have you ever been sent an email only to open your inbox and find that it's not there? You can use the search utility to find your missing emails. Let me show you how. The first thing I need to do to look for a missing email is to go up here to the search bar and click this little down arrow on the right hand side to bring up the search parameters. In this case I'm going to look for an email I sent myself a few weeks ago for a post that I'm working on for Envato. So since I know that I sent this message to myself I type in my other email address and I know that the subject line said the word Envato so I type that into the subject line I know that the message had an attachment because I put a graphic with the message. I know it was not a chat. And I know that my graphic was 85 kilobytes in size. So I'm going to search for 84. And then I know that I sent this message to myself within the past two weeks. So I select two weeks and today's date. Double check all of my parameters and I'm ready to run the search using the search icon in the left hand corner. Now at first glance it looks like the search utility did not find my message however you don't want to miss this very important message here that says some messages in trash or spam match your search. The reason this is important is because when you can't find a message a lot of times that's where it is in trash or spam. So let's go ahead and click the hyperlink here to see if that's where my message wound up. And sure enough, that is where it wound up in trash. So I actually want to move this message so that I can use it into my inbox and go back to my inbox and there it is. So we've just used the Gmail search utility to find a mess missing message. Let's go ahead and review the Gmail search utility fields open the Gmail search box and with this field you can select where you want to search any of the files or labels or categories that you have set up. In this field you're going to enter who the email that you're searching for is from. In this field if you're searching the sent mail or the drafts you can search who the email is to. If you know a word or phrase from the subject line of the email, you can enter that here. Or if you know a word or phrase from somewhere in the email, you can enter that here. If there's a word or phrase that you want to exclude from your search, enter that here. If you know that the message has an attachment, click this checkbox. And if you do not want to include chats in your search, click this checkbox. You can search by size or within a specific time frame. And when you run your search, you don't need to fill out every field. You can select one or two for as much information as you have. And then when you're ready to run the search, click the search icon in the lower left hand corner and that should narrow it down and help you to find your missing message. This has been Laura Spencer for Tuts Plus.